Wizzy, Wizzy. Ped, you should do a CTG sub special thing. Yeah, maybe one day. Alrighty, so we're back in. We've got the Vile Thorn, we've got the Space Gun, we've got the Sapphire Staff, we've got a bunch of cool new weapons. Luca Trey already donating a pound and says, How's it going? It's going well, thank you very much, Buddha. Um, alright, uh, so we started off with an infinite house, we've got all our chests and stuff laid out as we as you do. We still need Hermes boots, it's like the kind of the core sort of thing you need to get early on in the game. I'm gonna go show you guys our super beautiful wizard house though, after I get this this worm. Because we are gonna be doing some fishing at some point. Not anytime soon, possibly, I'm not sure. Who knows what we're gonna need later down the line. But here is our beautiful, beautiful wizard's tower. It's uh I made it purple just because I can, you know. It's just one of those things. And we're gonna be we're gonna be working on this tower quite a bit. We're gonna be ex ex moving all the chests from that area, moving them over here. And we're gonna be like making this our primary home. We'll make some beds and stuff. But for the time being, we, we need to finish it. So let's have a look. I kind of wanna. I kind of wanna. I'll take. Actually, no. I kind of want beams for the attic sort of thing. So I'll grab a bunch of beams. I also wanted some. I'll grab the. Do I have any stone? Oh, I do. There we go. I also wanted some of the planked walls. Get a bunch of those. I'll take this with me because we're relocating everything anyway, so I might as well take a couple of these things with me. Um, yeah, I'll leave everything else here for now. But we're gonna slowly be relocating like everything. Everyone's saying like that the, the wizard's tower is like <laughs> some abstract things. Come on, guys. <laughs> you can say it's a spaceship or a wizard's tower. Like it looks like a bit like a spaceship, right? <laughs> God dang it. I'm gonna be putting like wooden beams like up like this. How does that look? Wait, can you place like if I did that? Can I still place like this? I can't. Huh. So how am I gonna like wait, can I really not like put stuff in front of wooden beams? Or can I like disguise the wooden beams as something? Because wooden beams aren't really a background, are they? Okay, maybe wooden beams aren't very good for this. I thought they were working as like a background. Maybe we can just have like wooden back. Oh my god. An evil presence is watching us. All I was trying to do is build. <laughs> All right. Um. Oh my god. This is the um the expert mode one. So. I don't have Hermes boots either. All right. Um. Let's make some platforms ASAP. Are we dead? Is it all ogre? Please no. I've, I've got too much to live for. I'm too young to die. We can make a bridge over here. To be honest, that'd be really nice. But for now, it's just going to be our fighting area. Screw the rules, you know. Oh god, we're all doomed. Oh god. Is it... Am, am I going to die? I don't want to die. I'm too young to die. We might be fine, because we've got the space gun and stuff like that. That's really good against the eye of Cthulhu. But at the same time... God. We don't have Hermes boots or anything fancy, you know? The one thing I'm sad about is it's raining! And when it, it, I don't know why, whenever I play Terraria, like 50-50% of the time it's raining, you know? I don't think it's supposed to be like that. I think it's just because I'm English, the game is like, you know, let's make it rain, you know? I think that'd be funny. And the game's like, Bob Saget, where's he coming from? To the right! Alright, we're fine guys, alright? Kill your beans. Oh my goodness. Get away from me! Foul beast! We might be okay. We do have Cloud in the bottle and some other good stuff, you know? Now, I just need to perform some sick jukes, you know? I mean, keep in mind that I've killed the Eye of Cthulhu within like the first 11 minutes of being in the, in the world, you know? Oh snap, we just got a new subscriber, Polar Beat! Polar beasts, polar beasts. I can't read. I'm, I'm, I'm concentrating, you know. <laughs> and we got a donation as well. There's too many things going on. I don't got time for this. Thank you very much, guys. I appreciate that. Appreciate the support. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, that zombie just bit my booty. Oh no. You guys think we can do it? We don't have Hermes boots. Hermes boots is like the key ingredient, you know. 
The only reason I got the world record is because of the, the Hermes boots. Save the Hermes boots, save the world, you know? With the Hermes boots, you can achieve anything. No! Let's have the bow. Oh. Oh, got 10 seconds left. On my potion. Oh, the Jukes. No, no, no. Three seconds left. No, I was one second left on my potion. I was slapping it so hard. Ah, we got shrekt. What was his HP? Did anyone see? Oh my god, I can't believe it. Got Shrek. It was Luca Toro with a one pound donation that the donation at the start of that fight. Oh, I can't believe we just got Shrek. So hard. Rest in peaches. Oh, so sad. So sad. Oh well. Oh well. Maybe next time. 300 HP he had? Uh, how many like hits is that? I don't know, maybe I shouldn't have been using the, the vial thorn halfway through that. <laughs> 21 HP? <laughs> oh well. Oh well. It happens. These torches aren't permanent, they're just... They're just chilling out here for the time being, alright? We'll probably put like some lantern on the roof or something like that. Alright, we'll finish off this real quick. Just finish off the back wall so it looks pretty or whatever. If we just stripe it like this, it might look okay. Hmm. Oh god, what just happened there? a hole in there, I gotta fix it. How long has that been there? Do they look like the beams? They look okay. How do I re I, I wanna wanna make it look like the beams, you know, like this. But the beams, I can't I can't put anything down when I'm I'm using the beams, you know? I can't make it look super pretty. Maybe we can just use the the normal wall to start off with and maybe we can relocate, like, change it up later or something. Should I make this a bit wider? No. I think if we just did it stripey it might look attic enough, you know? It might look like a pretty attic. does kind of look good. I'd prefer beams, you know. But, hmm. I think this is okay for an attic, but I'd prefer beams, you know. Oh god, I can't even do it straight. Oh god, I'm destroying all the walls. I keep forgetting they changed how that works, you know. So you can just replace them instantly. It's supposed to be more efficient. But when I can't keep a straight hand... It's not more efficient for me. You know? Okay. There we go. Beautiful. Right? Is that how it's supposed to look? It looks okay. I'll probably put some different platforms up here. Maybe get the dungeon platforms. They might look really nice. Then I'll put some lanterns up. Make it look really attic -y. Maybe throw some cobweb up here or whatever. When I get the wizard, I'll throw some crystal balls up there, make it look super pretty. Get shrekt. As per usual, it, this is a Pedwin playthrough, so it rains for 40 days and 40 nights, as per freaking usual. And there's nothing I can do to stop it. The game's just like, hey Pedwin, we know how much you love it when it rains 20 days in a row. We know you love flying fish so much, so... Here you go, Pedgwen. I love the vial thorn just because I can shrek everything from out from the inside of houses. It's the best. It is indeed my favorite weapon. Nothing stands a chance. 
Alright, should I turn everything back into like wood? Probably, right? There we go. I can't turn these back, unfortunately. Correct. Okay, so what's next on the agenda? Get Hermes boots, progress, and live happily ever after. I think that's next on the agenda. Warding Shackle! That's a free fall defense. Alright, I'm gonna have to replace. No, I'll replace the shoe spikes. Screw it. We'll probably put some um, chests up in this area later on to make it feel more homey. But for now, we'll just we'll just bunk out in this area because we still need some basic stuff, which we're gonna get just from like running around. So we'll leave that for now. I'll give the um. <laughs> I really need to make that area bigger as well so I can actually put my good NPCs there, which would help. This guy. Because it's super hard to set your spawn point with all these guys running around. Should I give myself gold armor now that I've got this mage stuff? Or should I... Wait, where did I put my robes? There we go. Or should I wear the robes like this? But my helmet looks so nerd. I need a better helmet. This helmet looks... It doesn't look wizard enough, you know? Oh, is it daytime? Wait, what? I can't tell if it's daytime or not. Why does it rain? I wish there was some way to stop it raining. It's just... It makes the game so depressing. I hate it so much. It's the worst thing. I hate it. If I wanted to play a game that it's pitch black... I'd play... I don't know, what's a pitch black game, guys? Alright, I need help. I'd play Slender Man! There we go. It's pretty much pitch black, right? Pretty much. Pretty much. Get out of here. You too. Oh no, everyone's gonna say I'm a cheater! I didn't mean it. See? I didn't mean it! They weren't enemies, they were just harmless. <laughs> Alright, let's go underground and find those Hermes boots that we've been looking for all our life. Oh my goodness, another... I think those are our two deaths. Now, how many deaths have we had so far? We haven't had that many, alright? Oh my goodness, so many worms. I guess that's one benefit from it raining, I guess, right? So how far down did this go? Yeah, we can find somewhere down here. <laughs> I was like, cheater! Wasn't me, guys, alright? I do have a, um... A lucky horseshoe, so you don't have to worry about fall damage. Which is lovely. Where is it? Got it! If you see a Medusa, we gotta kill a Medusa. We're gonna go by that rule now. Considering we've got good enough stuff to kill said Medusa, so we might as well, right? Because if we get a ma uh, the Medusa's head, oh baby. It's like the best mage pre-hard weapon in the game, right? Pretty sure we can all agree on that one. Right, I'm just going to dig down from here. I don't care about these smooth marble blocks. Um, when are you planning to go on multiplayer? Um, I won't be playing any multiplayer on stream. I'll probably do some multiplayer... Um, off stream and then upload it to YouTube. So, if you just wanna, if you wanna play, just go on our server and just chill out. I'll be on one time. I've been meaning to do it for a while. God, spooky. Should I be taking the um silk? Do I still need gems? I guess I still need gems. I don't know. We can make like an amber staff later on. Then again, I still need fossils for that, right? I don't know. I guess we'll collect some silk. Because we still need gems. I don't know. Maybe we can make like diamond robes or a diamond staff. Still pretty good stuff. And 
maybe we'll get the secret pet. <gasps> or did they make it so it was um amber only? Or fossils only? I can't even remember. Oh, there's actually a chest down there. Don't mind if I do. Even that chandelier. I love taking down the chandeliers and just throwing them back up. I don't know. I can't get enough. Of it. Can't get enough of it, you know. Load of lead down here. Might as well blow our way through. Bada boom. I'll take that chest as well while I'm at it. Don't really need the anvil. Got millions of them at this point. Ped, you missed a lunar flare in the chest. Nicely mean. Flail, Gwyn. Hey, the flail playthrough's over, alright? Oh. Is a space gun? No, it's a, it's a mage weapon. We're doing traditional um, rules. We're we're only using um, things that say mage damage, and the and they actually say mage damage. So, oh wow, well, that would have been a nice little enchanted sword, wouldn't it? If only. Apparently. Oh, that's water as well. Oh my god, there's water everywhere. This is the worst part about being underground. You suddenly just find a lake of water and you're like, god dang it. Oh, there's some amethyst down there. That's nice. There's a mouse in the corner. Oh, there's a heart crystal as well. Don't mind if I do. Also guys, if you guys want to stay, if you guys want to be useful, what you can do is look at the no creatures nearby, and if you see a nymph, start screaming, because then we'll get the, um, the treasure thing, it tells us when treasure's nearby. So, because I, I always neglect to look at that, so if you want to be useful, that's how you get in my good books, you see? Easy. That's how you get in my good books. Come on. Oh, there's a chest over there of some sort. Got him. Mm. Gold. Don't mind. Gold. Oh, snap. We got Parker. Pa Parker Roby, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the Penguin Club. Not to be confused with Penguin. Hope you enjoy your stay. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really do appreciate the support, Buddha. I hope you enjoy your stay. You are now a pet head. You're awesome gentleman, you. No, oh, this is an... Oh, is that a... What is that? Another chest? And... Oh, my goodness. Hello there. Nice to see you. Bombs. Okay. Um, okay, what was in here again? <laughs> Got a bit distracted. Danger sense potion? Hmm. Okay, we'll take this stuff for the time being. Where are worms? There we go. I can throw them in there. Someone was telling me to do that before, but I completely neglected to to even take it into consideration. I'm so sorry. All right. Let's keep on moving. Oh, we got a another one pound donation from Nicotaria, and he says, "Nymph in the beehive." What? You silly sausage. You love those one pound donations. It's just like having a a chat all day long. <laughs> Still appreciate it. Nymph? You guys are trolling, right? The boy who cried nymph. Yeah, I see. I see. Well, you guys are going to be saying nymph and I'm not going to believe you. Because you guys spammed it so much. You guys were saying it so much. I will never believe. You know? Oh, that's good. But let's go in the um, treasure first. One of the sunflower statue. Should I be taking all these statues? I've been taking so many. Now my inventory is, like gets so full so fast. Actually, I do have a piggy bank on me, so we can work that out, I suppose. Yeah, I can just throw the piggy bank down and like throw all the statues in there. I really need to make a decoration like chest on the surface. Else, I'm just gonna have this is gonna be full 24/7. <laughs> Quick stack. Okay, good enough. Um, oh my goodness, what a nightmare! My inventory. Bloody hell. 
Oh well. Is there something else in here? Oh wait, I didn't even look in here. What the heck? What the heck's wrong with me? Don't mind if I do. I can't put that. Damn it. I would if I could. Oh well. Still searching. Should we take these traps for monies? I don't even know. I feel like my inventory is going to get too full. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of emeralds. Can I even carry them? Okay, I got a bit in the inventory space. Ugh. Lost girl back there. Bound goblin. <gasps> Which direction? Up here? It's got to be, right? Oh, there he is! Hello there, sir. Right next to the, the statue as well. Oh, baby. Don't mind if I do. Alright, I'll take those for the time being. And what else we got? Tinkerer's Workshop. Oh, baby. So we got rocket uh, we got rocket boots before we even got Hermes. Rest in pepperonis. We're doomed. Got a ruler for one gold. I think I'm going to take that because I'm going to be doing lots of building this this um, run. I'm not going to buy a tool belt for 10 gold. That's a bit, a bit too much. It's extortionate, you know? You're crazy. Eee, crazy. Oh, some more sapphire up there. Ripped. Do we have some sapphire on us, or is this just gonna drop? Oh, get rid of throwing knives, I suppose. All right, there we go. Gems are always good. You never know when we want a a robe, like anything, you know. Gems, and they're also worth quite a lot, you know. Go figure. Gems being worth a lot. Who would have known? Boom. Chandelier. Still no Medusas. Day 550,000. Still no Medusa. Oh my goodness. Speak of the devil. Ain't that girl? You got your buddy coming along as well. Well I got mana for days. Oh my goodness. I know she could open doors. Get out of here. We gotta try and get lucky with the head. Try and get some head from uh, Medusa. As per usual. I mean who doesn't right? Kappa Kappa. Frank Z. White horse shoe balloon. White horse shoe. Wait. Oh. Oh. God dang it! I just ripped out my earphones. One second, guys. <laughs> I can't hear the sounds. No. Oh my god. My computer's making all the doo 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 doo. Can you guys hear that? Hopefully not. Rest in pe pepperonis. All right. Um. Where was we? I was about to make. Some people in chat were saying, make the balloon in the bottle. Alright, sounds good to me. But is. Wait. Oh, I already had. Oh, this is going to save a lot of inventory space. Because I can put this here. Oh my god, and we live happily ever after. Oh wait, no, I could just put this here if I really wanted to. And then put that there. Oh baby. No, we really do live happily ever after. If I put these here, they don't actually count. Right? No, they don't. I wish they did. Come on. We gotta be like this game. Anything else we can do? Look at that salamander. Looking all fancy. I'm trying to be fancy. He ain't nothing. Shoe spikes? Sure, why not? Feather fall potion? I guess. Oh, God. How did a slime open a door? That's cheating. Get out of here, slime. How did a slime shut a door? Oh, it's because of the button. Oh, I see. Got him. Uh, javelins don't sell for anything. I don't know why. Considering they're so cool and awesome and everything like that, right? You expect them to sell for something. But they don't. What a joke. Uh, <sighs> Someone said... Mr. Ayaka Cthulhu trick. What are you talking about? What you talking about? Alright, uh, let's get rid of the statues. Considering how many statues I've got, I've got like no duplicates or anything. Is there anything else I can even put in here? That? Alright, whatever. It's, it's full now. Why do I have a grave marker still? Ow! It's darkening me. Okay, let's search the rest of this area so we can just 
go back on with our day. Whoa, we ended up in the ice biome, how lovely. Anything up here? Nothing. Let me check down here a little bit. Never know what's lurking in the corner. More javelins that don't sell for anything. Flurry boots, flurry boots. I didn't get any flurry boots. Oh, you mean you can get them from the ice farm? I mean, flurry boots are exactly the same as normal boots. Hermes boots, you know, I mean, there's no, like, increased chance. We should probably search the rest of the, down here. This area was so...